Hey everyone, and welcome back to some more Journey Down. So, we are about to enter this woman's room. Remember way back when, um, when we first got here with our prison outfits, there's this lady in the window, drops her matches, makes us come over and get them, and then disappears. We don't know why it even happened, we don't understand why she did what she did, but it, she did it. <laughs> um... But no, now we now it's raining. We got our jacket. We got the lighthouse working. We got everything back in order, basically, in this town, and we have a whole bunch of crap in our inventory. Um, we have bolt cutters still, but now we have a car here. Fancy car! Whoever owns this ride has got to be filthy rich. It probably belongs to someone in Club Denver. Probably. So can we not? Oh, I really hope we get to steal it. I hope so. But let's just, you know. Let's just get right to it. Let's enter the. Oh, oh, what is this place? This is the mayor's office. Oh. You're the mayor of Port Achu? <laughs> no, silly. I am his secretary. I manage his appointments, meetings, and weekly schedules. I take his calls, mail his letters, file his documents, run his errands, and sort his cigars. Cool. This job is a real drag, and the pay is lousy. Honestly, I just want to get out of this place. I wish I was up in St. Armando. Now that is a city with a heart and a soul. So what is your name, Mr. Nani? I'm Andiswa, but my friends call me Andy. I'm Buana. Pleasure meeting you, Buana. I would socialize, but I've got a ton of work left to do tonight. <laughs> nice cigars. That is a box of Senor Muete. They are specially imported from Pango Kupwa. The mayor says they are the best cigars ever made. He is very particular about his cigars. So. I still have yet to understand what she wants, but. It's locked in place. Sorry, fire equipment can only be removed in case of emergency. All right, so we That's gotta fun. use the matches to light this, to start the smoke alarm, to then unhook that from whatever. So that's that's what I'm thinking right now. Um, train station. It's Morton's lighthouse. Yeah, it is a good thing someone finally fixed it. When the lighthouse was sabotaged, the whole city just kind of stopped. It was beginning to make everyone here kind of creeped out. Okay, so that's where we came from. Club Temba, the harbor, distillery. Have we been to the distillery or is that just... That doesn't make sense. Train station, we haven't been there yet. Cemetery, haven't been there yet. Haven't been to hospital or NOLA. We haven't been to... We've been to the industrial zone as well. I don't understand how the distillery, it should be right here. Whatever, we're not gonna think too much about it. Um, let's go. What's upstairs? Mayor's office. He's never here though. The mayor is working from inside Club Ten. And by working, I mean greasing his palms and spending the city's tax money on his lovers. Okay, can I not go up there? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that could get Andy fired. I better not. Oh, come on. Sorry, Buana. Visitors are not allowed past this desk. Mayor's orders. Alright. Can I go over here? No? Is there, is there any reason to be in this area? No. Do you want a boat? Oh, maybe she like this. Hey, check this out. What's this? Wow. These pictures are amazing. I could just dream myself off to St. Armando on one of those ships right now. Wow. So, uh...
Yes. Hey, hey, what are you doing? I'm uh, just testing the smoke detector. Uh, come on, turn it off. Uh... Just push the button on the side, will you? Thanks. Sweet. Ha 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 ha. Okay, can I also get the box of nice cigars? That is above me. Dang it. The mayor. Okay, okay, okay. Terminal? Hey, Andy, mind if I use the computer? Go ahead. What do I care if I get fired? I just want to get out of here. Knock yourself out. Yes. Awesome. Thanks, Andy. Oh. Oh, I don't know what to use the computer. God, why would I need to use the computer? Probably have to come back here later, but whatever. Um, cool, that's a good start. Let's try this guy's door, because... Really? Fancy kit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, well, now I'm stuck again. Why the heck would I need a fire extinguisher? Oh. There's a lot of people out here. Oh, and the cinema's open now. Sorry, these ladies. Excuse me, ladies. Ever heard of someone named Kaunandodo? Sorry, I don't know what you're talking about. We are just here waiting for our ride. Okay. That's it. Well, I guess we'll try the cinema. Nice. There's a sign on the ticket booth. It says tickets for tonight's show will be available shortly. I have to wait even longer? It's a taxi cab, but there's no taxi driver around. Okay. Baron's Gold. A twisting tale of airplanes, goblins, and riches galore. That movie sounds awesome! Okay, we'll see it. Moana. Um. Nothing yet, I guess. Dang it. Dang it, dang it. <laughs> oh, wait, can I go? Oh! This is new. No, it's not. It's just the boat's gone. Rubber boat, crane. Lighthouse. Maybe the door to this place is now. The door to the train station is locked. The crane? That's one huge crane. What can I? Hmm. I wonder what this little bit does. <laughs> Oops. Yes. Look at that. Got more stuff. I don't think we're gonna need the lighthouse for anything more, right? Let's check this out. Who do you think you're fooling, Mo? We're never gonna be able to push this produce. Only reason the Sisulus didn't grab it is because it's dried up and halfway rotten. Shut up, Vince. Someone's coming. Hey, kid. Wanna buy some corn? It's, uh, prime stuff. Straight from the farm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, prime corn. Fresh from the farm. Fresh from the, uh, cows or whatever. Sorry, guys. I got no money. We could trade. We're big on trading. Yeah, yeah, let's trade. I'd like a big fat bottle of eel rings. Yeah, <laughs> that'd be nice. And how about some cigars? It's about time men of our ability get to enjoy the good life. We're men of class, you know. Men of class should be enjoying a classy life. Ain't that right, Vince? That's right, Mo. There you have it, kid. <laughs> get us some cigars and a bottle of eel rings. And this beautiful crate of prime corn is all yours. Okay. You guys heard of a man named Kaunandodo? Nakadodo? Uh, wait, isn't that that guy who had a thing with that girl on the flats? You know, what was his name? Guy was always limping, had a funny way of walking. Oh, yeah, you mean that guy who was running the bricks for the old stooge over on 6th, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, now I know. You're talking about Tommy Three Legs. Yeah, yeah, that's the guy. 
Yeah, his name ain't uh, Kno Doko or whatever. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Okay. So. Mind if I take a look into your crits? Get us some booze first, kid. And cigars. Right. All right. Well, crap. We need to go back. Oh. That guy's new. Hey, can you believe this? What? I do this job job for chum change day after day, and Hustler Mac sell me a bus tire. Good for nothing but a trip around the block. When he laid his racket, it sure sound clean. But now I know who's the fool. He played me cut rate, and that ain't cool. I'm a old Hustler Mac, a slap in the face for that chum deal. I don't know what he just said. Name's Rod Reynolds. That's R for real. Oh. So your taxi's broken? Yeah, I know you want to roll with Rod Reynolds. That's R for rhythm. I got the smoothest jam in town. Like silk on wheels. I bring my customers to their destination. Every time. Isn't that what a tax is supposed to do? But now, however, there is a slight predicament. My front tire's gone bust, and that sucker Hustler Max got his jive shop closed this hour. I don't quite know what to do. Put me in a bit of a pickle. If I had me a new tire, I'd take you wherever you want to go. But right now, it looks like I'm stuck for the night. I'll see you around. Okay. Stay on top, Jack. In Port Archu, you gotta be street smart and steal hard. Remember that. Okay, what can I make? Oh. Look, I got a rubber boat. Ain't that something? You going for a boat ride? I don't think so. I'm not sure why I'm carrying this around, <laughs> to tell you the truth. <laughs> not sure why I'm carrying this around. Oh, I was hoping he could, like, fashion it into some sort of wheel. Who knows? Well, he's there now. Um, no clue why. I going near that meat stick again. You'll throw me right back in the dumpster. Yeah, 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 yeah. So there's that way, and there's... Oh, okay. So, okay. Let's go back to this place. Hey, man. Well, look who's awake. Catching up on your beauty sleep in the dumpster? Yeah, um, I'm having a bit of a rough night. Rough night? Ha, <laughs> let me guess. High rolling in club tempo on champagne and stardust. And tossed out the back door as soon as your credit dried up? Will I land crab? What? How did, why is he mad at me? Oh, here we go. Well, look who's back. The night is shining up. You rescued your princess yet? I tried, uh, but I wound it up in a dumpster with nothing but a beaten and a bad headache. That woman is mixed up in some real bad stuff. So you ain't gonna help her no more? I'm pretty sure she won't be needing my help. I'm done chasing after her. I've got a new lead now. <laughs> like getting drunk? That's usually what a fella does around here after he gives up on a lady. No. I got a lead on my old man. He disappeared a couple years ago up in St. Armando. Haven't heard a word from him since. But now I know he's been true here. Someone here in Port Archie has got to know where he went. What's his name? Kaunandodo. He was a pilot. A big, hard, long dreads, Nazi Rasta. Well, that name rings a bell, but I have no idea where I've heard it. It wasn't recently. I know that much. You might want to try asking around town. Will do. Alright, so I do have to ask everyone about it. So, is that... Can I get a drink? Yo! What can I help you with, sir? Uh, I want you. I want you to rinse. Sure thing. It's five bucks a box. Man, I don't have any cash. Uh, can you put it on my tab or something? Man, I'm sorry, sir. No cash, no drinks. Well then, I got to hit the streets. How oh, my... sir? I I got a bottle. Hey, uh, you awake? Yeah, there are fish and drinkers, Mister. These poor fellas had a run in with the Sisulus. The Sisulus? You mean the pirates? 
Yes, sir. There's some bad news, Osasulu. Some real bad news. A ruthless, bloodthirsty bunch, they are. Uh, apparently, they've been pillaging to the left and to the right ever since the lighthouse was broken. Good thing it's finally working again, so now the ships can start finding their way back into port. But by the time these fellas came back, oof, they were broken men. Yeah, a lot of emotions had to be processed after a terrifying event like that. Three bottles of emotion, to be more precise. So... Buana's rude boy plumbing at your service. What did I do? What? Gross, man! Holy crap, I did it. What a what? What? What is going on? I think the drain is empty, yum yum. I need to find something else to fill the rest of the bottle with. Are you kidding me? Well, I gotta go find something else then. Dear God. Bottle, bottle, bottle. So it's a little full. Can I just like do the rain or the, the... Wasn't there? Oh, I know the boat's gone though. Um, there's the lobster stew. That won't do. Oh boy, oh boy. Is there anything... I can fill with? I honestly think this is my only chance here. There! Now the bottle is filled to the brim. Yes! That's one nasty cocktail. Perfect! Okay, now we need cigars. So, how the heck am I going to get the cigars? How am I going to get these cigars from her? I don't know. Um, I don't want to give it back already. This is the perfect toy. I want these. <laughs> I'm pretty. <sighs> what can I do? What can I do? Hey, look, I've got a book about boats and eels and stuff. Ugh, I am so fed up with this whole misting industry. I have so had enough of it. I just want to get out of here. I need to get her to leave. Hey, check it out, Andy. I've got a toy ship. Mm -hmm. It's a ghost ship. Aren't you afraid? Ooh, big scary boat coming to get you. Ooh. Yeah, okay, Buana, can you stop talking now, please? What can I scare her with? I have a feeling, and. Okay. Hey, I see your matches are from Club Temba. You go there a lot? Is that a joke? Me at Club Temba? <laughs> that will be the day. I never get to have any fun. Well then freaking go. Terminal. I don't I don't know what to do. I don't think she's interested. Hey Andy, wanna see my plunger? Wow, Buana. You sure know how to make a gal feel special. Lord, um... Hey, Andy! I brought some eel rinse. Wanna get hammered? <laughs> That's very thoughtful of you, Buona. But I've got a ton of work to do. Looks like you're going to have a one-man party. Having fun just isn't my lot in life. <laughs> what can I do? Want bolt cutters? I don't... Oh, I have no idea what to do with the computer. No clue. Do I? Do I want to do it again? Hey, hey, what are you doing? I'm, uh, just... Come up. Thanks. Uh, give me some cigars. Can I have a couple cigars? I'm really not allowed to give away the mayor's cigars. But I 
Oh my gosh, I just had to click on him. Go ahead. I Yes. Thanks, Sandy. Nice. Wow. Oh see, sometimes it's just so simple as to click on it, and other times it's like you have to do a whole damn puzzle. Alright, here we go. Yeah, man. Look what I got ya. Well, I'll be damned, kid. That's some fine stuff, too. Ooh. What you got there? Wow, they're real Senor Muerte cigars. Fancy brand. Good job, kid. Hey, these aren't fresh. They're all dried up and rotten. Sorry, kid. Deal's a deal. That's right, kid. Gotta honor the deal. Now we have corn. We did all that for corn. Um, well, I think that's gonna be it for this episode. We, we're making progress. Uh, it's just, it's slow progress. It really is. Like, we're doing a lot, but it doesn't seem to be getting us, like, I don't know, stuff isn't totally, I, I have a plunger and a freaking rubber boat and corn. Like, what the heck am I gonna do with this stuff? I have no clue. But anyways, I will see you guys next time. Peace.